Kumusta? Ang pangalan ko, Ms. Stair. Hello, my name is Ms. Stair, and I am the music teacher at Concord International School. Our lesson this week is going to focus on the beautiful world around us, how our voices matter, and how we can use them to shape the world around us. So in our lesson today, we have five main activities. Our first activity is called Nubes Azules, and it is a greeting song. For this song, actually, because it is about the beautiful world around us, I'm going to do something special, and I'm going to step outside of my house to sing with a guest. Now, our second activity is going to be a warm-up movement activity with a rhyme from Ella Jenkins. Our third activity today is found sounds and ostinati. We're going to be finding some instruments in the world around us. Our fourth activity is Escúchenos, Listen to Us, um, a song written by Concord students in Mr. Lindahl and Ms. Schneethor's class, and we're going to use our instruments for that activity as well. We will close with the book Little Night, Nochecita, and Bring Everything Together. I'm excited to make some music with you today. Let's get started. This is one of my favorite songs by Suni Paz and Elizabeth Mitchell, Nubes Azules, or Blue Clouds, Blue Sky. Now, this song in its original version has some beautiful guitar playing, and I am not very confident in my guitar skills quite yet. I'm learning, I'm learning. Um, but I'm lucky enough to have Stephanie with me, so she's going to play the guitar part and we're going to sing Nubes Azules together. Thank you again for being a guest on our music class today. Each verse has a part, and it begins with the same words. It begins with, Buenas noches, cariño. Let's try both of those separately. Will you repeat after me? Let's try. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Cariño. Cariño. All that means is, good night, dear one. So each verse starts out with, good night, dear one. Buenas noches, cariño. Let's see how it sounds when we sing it. Should we do it together? Yeah. Here we go. So listen and join in the second time. Buenas noches, cariño. Join in. Buenas noches, cariño. Nice. So each verse will begin with Buenas noches, cariño. Now you know your part, so you can join us. Now at the very end of each verse, there's also a very similar part. I love this part because it's really easy to teach folks. I'm not going to tell you why, but let's see if you can guess. I want you to listen. Uh, we'll do it twice. So why don't you join in the second time? Here we go. Yep, it's some of the easiest words to memorize. I memorized that part of the song first, not trying to brag. Um, ooh, 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 ooh. Just sing along with that part at the end. So we start out with Buenas Noches, Cariño, and end each verse with some oohs. Let's give it a try from the beginning. We have three verses total. Let's join on in. Ready? Join with me. Buenas noches, cariño. Se alza plateada la luna. Te quiero más que al mismo sol. Que la lluvia que baña mariposas. A la Sagrado via 
Estrellas azules sobre un cielo de oro, las aves cantando junto a los cocoyos, un manto de estrellas detrás de tus ojos. Thank you so much for joining us. Let's do a chant to warm up our voices, bodies, and breath. I have a chant for you today, and the chant goes like this. I am walking, I am walking, and I'm feeling mighty fine. I am walking, I am walking, and I'm walking with a picket sign. Now, I want you to take a look at a few of the students from my school last year in Ms. Murray, Ms. Dunphy, and Senor Sanchez's class going on a march with picket signs. You'll see that picket sign means a kind of sign that people carry, typically in a protest, that has their message on it. Now the students in those classes that you saw in the picture had just done a unit with their teachers about We the Future. And after that unit, they decided that they wanted to organize a march, carrying picket signs, much like the ones you see here. Let's take a look at some of those We the Future posters as we try out our rhythm. This time, I'm gonna use the back of my ukulele. Here we go. I am walking, I am walking, and I'm feeling mighty fine. I am walking, I am walking, and I'm walking with a picket sign. Good. This time at the end, I want you to imagine that you have a picket sign in your arm and take in two deep breaths with me. You know what? If we're going to do it once, let's just do it three times. Breathing in and out. Here we go. One, two, three. I am walking. I am walking. And I'm feeling mighty fine. I am walking. I am walking. And I'm walking with a picket sign. two, and three. Now, after learning about We the Future activists, students in these three classes chose what they wanted their voices to be heard on. Some students said that they wanted to shape the world and make it a better place by being earth guardians and encouraging others to join them, protecting our planet. Other folks decided to write about Black Lives Matter and how that can change our communities and how our actions can reflect that we believe Black Lives Matter. Other students chose to advocate for the LGBTQIA community. Other students chose to write about how we can end gun violence and save lives. Whoever you are, Whatever it is that you believe, I hope that you can find a way that you can use your voice to shape the world. We can make music with just about anything. During today's activity, we are going to use at least four instruments that are from the world around us. Now that world could be from outside, if it is safe for you to go outside very quickly, or from inside. Now, instruments. They can be any object. I want you to see if you can think of an instrument, which could be a found object, that whistles, that rattles when you shake it, 
software that makes an interesting noise when you strike it. Make sure that you find at least four and see if you can find some that have different kinds of sounds, different timbres. Maybe one is really high, maybe one is really low, maybe one is really rich, maybe one is really tinny and high. Go ahead and find at least four objects. Hopefully you have found your four objects. I know that I have found a few and I'd like to share them with you. One thing that I found was some dry peas. Now, this wasn't super obvious, but when I take it, it makes kind of a rattling noise. So I could try it out like this. And another one that I found was a small shelf and a kitchen utensil. See if you can play one of your instruments with me, the second one. Here we go. Can you say ta, 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 di, ta, di? Try it again. All right. Let's see if we can choose our favorite of the instruments so far and try it out with our rhythm. Ta, 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 di, ta, di. One, two, and I'll play with a rhythm stick, the whiteboard. That'll be my instrument. One, two, three, here we go. Ta, 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 di, ta, di, ta, 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 di, ta, di. Now your ostinato can be the same as mine or it can be different, but I want you to think of a pattern that you like to do on your instrument. Take a minute. Good, you should have a pattern that you can repeat now. We're gonna try and play our made up instruments, our found sounds, along with a song called Escuchenos. Now I'm not gonna teach you the words to this one, but they're pretty easy. Escuchanos. I'll sing the refrain. Escuchanos, 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 escuchanos. And then I want you, after the refrain, while I'm singing the verse, to play your rhythm. So you'll sing along with me maybe while I sing Escuchanos. And then while I'm singing, you get to play a rhythm. So it would sound something like this. Nuestras voces son importantes, escuchen nuestras ideas. Nuestras voces son importantes, escuchen nuestras ideas. So I want you to try to play your rhythm along with me while I play the ukulele. And that doesn't have to be perfect. Just add something to this song that you feel like would sound good with it. Once again, this song was written by Concord students in Mr. Lindahl and Ms. Schneethor's class. We hope that you enjoy. You're playing along. Nuestras voces son importantes. Escuchen nuestras ideas. Escúchanos, 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 escúchanos. Escúchanos, 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 escúchanos. Get ready to play. Nunca eres demasiado pequeño para ser la diferencia. Nunca eres demasiado pequeño para ser la diferencia. Escúchanos, 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 escúchanos. Thank you for trying out your instrument on our song. Let's keep moving. Little Night, Nochecita, by Yuji Morales.
Little Knight. For today, I'm going to read it just in English for time. As the long day comes to an end, Mother Sky fills a tub with falling stars and calls. Bath time for Little Knight! Little Knight answers from afar. Can't come. I am hiding and you have to find me, Mama. Find me now! Hmm. Mother Sky looks down a rabbit hole. She puts her cheek on the darkest sand. When she peeks behind the hills, whom does she see? Get your first instrument out and let's play along. I found you, I found you, my little knight. Face scrub, lather up, towel spread, and catch little knight in the air. As the sun sets so red, Mother Sky unfolds a dress crocheted from clouds and calls. Dressing time for little knight. Little knight hops out of her chair. Not now, not yet, not until you find me, mama. Don't forget to close your eyes. Where could you be? Mother Sky hovers by the shade of trees. She searches in the stripes of bees. When she peeks inside the bat's cave, whom does she see? Get your next instrument ready. I found you, I found you, my little knight. Two arms in, one head out, button the dress crocheted from clouds. As the warm of the day fades, Mother Sky fills up a glass of milk and serves pancakes on a plate. She calls, time to eat, little knight. Little knight dashes past the table. Count first, mama, from one to 10. It is going to be hard to find me this time. Mother Sky counts. One, two, three. Let's see. Mother Sky looks inside the old barn. She pats the raven chicks. When she brushes her hand over the blueberry field, whom does she see? Get your next instrument ready. I found you, I found you, my little knight. Creamy mustache, lips lick, stars dripping from the Milky Way to drink. As fireflies and moths come out, Mother Sky sits on her rocking chair, waving her comb. She calls, time to comb your hair, little knight. But what does she hear? Only the hushing of the balmy wind. Mother Sky looks around, but Little Knight is not peeking from behind the hills, nor is she hiding in the cave, nor vanishing into the field. Where could my Little Knight be? Peekaboo, Mama, I am right here. Let's try that on the comb or on whatever instrument you're using. Peekaboo, Mama, I am right here. Mother Sky sits Little Knight on her lap, and with her shiny comb, she untangles the knots twists the hair between her fingers and makes little swirls on the left, one on the left side, one on the right side. To keep them in place, she takes three hairpins from her pocket. Venus is on the east, Mercury on the west, and Jupiter above. Now, my little knight, take your moon ball and play. I can catch it, mama. See me bounce it high into the air. And that is the end of our book. There is nature and beauty in the world around us that we want to preserve for those that we care about. Remember that you can use your voice to shape what our world looks like. If you remember nothing else from this lesson, I hope that you remember your voice matters. Thank you for joining me in music making today.